What's up guys, I'm back for some Call of Duty Black Ops Team Deathmatch number two and the class I shall be using today is probably one of my favorite guns in the game. It's probably the best it's the best SMG in the game even though I've unlocked it. It's the 74U with a grip ghost I believe steady aim and a useless tactical mask. The reason I put grip on this is because if you have grip and steady aim on this thing, it becomes a beast. In the sense that, um, how should I put this? Is the fact that it rarely lowers the recoil. It, it will barely have any with the grip and steady aim. Um, some other perks I would recommend, even though I haven't unlocked them yet, would be a warlord. You can put a grip and extended mags and pretty much rush the rush their spawn. And a pro tip, do not hide in a corner when I have a fresh frag grenade. Just, it just doesn't turn out very good. Get what I'm saying? This guy's totally oblivious to everything that goes on around him. And the sniper. That's actually... Guys are pretty camouflaged in this game. And, um, why is this game called the Chopper Guy Massacre? You will find out. Um, I've redirected my thoughts on this game for my first impressions I do know you can get a lot of COD points now from just the contracts so it's not necessary to play the wager matches but I have to admit I've played a lot of them the only one I haven't played yet is Sticks and Stones I have to admit they're all very fun the only one I don't necessarily like so far is um, Sharpshooter it's not bad I just think the other ones are better and it's just my opinion uh, personally my favorite one so far is one in the chamber some people may find, might say, oh, it's just people camping and um, just, you know, your corners. And that's only in a few cases. I've I've never run into a whole entire lobby where all they do is camp as so I run around. Because this is one thing they did very smart in the, um, for the one in the chamber game type, wager mode game type, is that you have to have the most, guy, guy with the most kills wins the, wins the, um, the gunfight wins. Uh, wins the COD points, gets the grand prize of a gr And I mostly play a weekend gambler just because I enjoy it. I I usually don't go in a high roller just because because I'm a little pussy and I don't want to and I don't like gambling all my money away. Oh poor Thomas. And here's where I could have messed up, but this guy's totally oblivious to anything. I really should have switched my pistol there and just took him out. But hey, what can you do? The knife in this game is pretty broken. Almost as broken as Ball for twos. Uh, the kill streaks I'm using today is the Spy Plane, the Napalm Airstrike, and the Chopper Gunner. I believe this is one of the more better kill streaks to use, and I have to admit, uh, another good kill streak to use is the Spy Plane, Blackbird, and a slat. And you can use any high power kill streak for last. Um, most likely a Chopper Gunner. I'm probably going to unlock a Tat Dogs. I haven't really unlocked many kill streaks. Yeah, I unlocked the Sam turn just to help me get the Hardline Pro, and I do have Hardline Pro at, as I record the, my voice at this time. And right now, I'm about to go on my Chopper Gunner, and the Chopper Gunner, this was back on like the second day of the game, first came out, and nobody shot down air support at that time except for maybe me a few times. And now people are really starting to shoot down air support, so I recommend if you're really going to run with a you know, a flying kill streak. I really recommend the gunship because it has two sets of flares. Or use the attack dogs. Attack dogs, you may only get 70, seven of them. You know, in a pack of three at first and a pack of four. But usually they'll just, you know, rape face. I mean, look at this. These guys have no chance against this thing. I love this chopper gunner. But as you see, you see, they tried to fire some at me. And I think my flares were setting off. Then I kept killing him before he could try to do it again. But I have to admit, my favorite kill streaks so far have to be, even though I haven't unlocked them, the attack dogs. Well, all three of the major kill streaks, you know, the gunship, the chopper, and the attack dogs are really good. They're really cool. I have to say, the napalm I really do like just because who doesn't like seeing people burn? And that's the end of the chopper gunner. I believe it got me around 20 kills, 20 or some kills. It's just, it's just a massacre when you get that chopper gunner on this map. This Nuketown and Jungle are a massacre for gunships and air supports. Even though it's a big building in the center. Oh, I get owned right there. I have to say I'm going to probably be running Hacker a lot more just because people have been running with, you know, more motion sensors, claymores, and, sp and camera spikes. 
I have to say I'm probably going to be using a hacker a lot more. Try to get hacker pro. Hacker pro is supposedly supposed to be a very powerful kill streak. Um, and I like the napalm airstrike. Who doesn't love raining fire down on somebody? It's just very fun. Now, how do I feel about this game's spawn system? I believe the spawn system's pretty bad in this game, but it's not the worst. I do believe Modern Warfare 2's spawn system is still pretty bad, pretty worse. Um, I don't know, but that's still not my um full opinions of the game. Like before, when Modern Warfare 2 came out, I thought it was like you know the best game ever, and so far, I'm thinking it for this game. We'll just have to see. I'll give a second opinion. Um, about three months after the game comes out, maybe in like January, I'll give another opinion because that's why I started to hate Modern Warfare 2 a lot. Um, but how do I feel about the maps? I believe the maps are very good. There's a few maps. Well, I like Nuketown. The fact is, when people choose it six or five times in a row, it just gets tedious, annoying, and tiresome. And this guy has very bad aim. We're just going to punish him for that. And this guy tries to rock at me, but thank God I have an Ogvar secondary. <laughs> Who needs shotgun secondaries, am I right? And right now I'm going to call on my, what is it, my Napalm Strike. And this is going to be one of the funniest kill cams I've ever, final kill cams I've ever seen. And just watch this. Um, who? This guy's about to get burned for being OTT. And if you don't know, OTT is just no word for AFK. And OTT means on the toilet. But that's it for me. Final score was 38 and 2. 74 used my f is a very good gun. I'll see you guys later.